welcome to the Word at Work Help Desk. Today I'm going to show you how, in brief, to use our ebooks. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is find the ebook. If you saved it on your desktop, you're going to look for this icon. See? It's this little uh, silver arrow looking thing, and it'll be the name of the ebook, whether it's Purifying or Sure Mercies. Okay, so once you find that, here it is on my desktop. You're going to double click and it'll open. It may ask you if you want to run it. If it does, you can click yes, you want to run it. Now look at, in it, on the bottom right hand corner it says click here. When you put your mouse there, the little page flips up. And that means it's ready for you to turn the page. So, you put your mouse in the bottom right hand corner and it'll flip up and that means you can turn the page. And you put your mouse in the bottom left hand corner, same goes. You can flip the page to the left. Anytime you see blue text, like here, that means you can click that link and go right to where it says. So here are important instructions. So it'll give you pictures of each of the different things I'm showing you now. And if you want to go to the table of contents, or chapter one, or watch an instructional video online. Okay, so let's say we want to go to the table of contents. Here we are. Any of these links will take you directly to the chapter that it's referencing. Chapter 1, what is an altar? Goes right to chapter 1. Okay, let's go back to the table of contents. Let's see. And by going in the right hand corner, you can see what I'm doing now. This is the entire uh, book right here. So from page 0, it'll go to the front to page 376, and it'll go to the back. Now, if you notice, I put my mouse in the upper right hand corner, there are two options. One is to minimize, and you know what that does, that just shrinks the window. If I minimize it, you see it went down here. And now you see I'm going there with my mouse, and I'm going to click, and it'll come right back up. The second option up here was a big X, and most of us know that means to close something out. So if I close it, it'll open up right to the same page where I closed it. And that's pretty handy if you're reading because, as we all know, whoever remembers what page they were on. Okay, a couple other options that you have is to return to the very front of the book, and that's by clicking this, and you'll see the uh, book information. And the second option up here is you'll see a little picture of a printer. And if you click that, then your printer box will pop up and you can print it. Alright, that is how to use your ebook. And happy reading!